Hey guys, welcome to my video. Today I'm going to show you why these pop-up allow location access boxes are a scam. Okay, so to demonstrate that this is a total scam, and no website really needs to show this prompt to know your location, I created a small website. This website poses to guess the location of the user by their answers to the questions. If the user is skeptical, they can press the skeptical button. They are then redirected to a page that asks them for consent to find their location. However, I have made the site to tell the user to press block because the site can apparently guess it based on their answers. So, spoiler alert, your answers to these questions really don't matter and are not even stored. So, once all four questions are answered, you are redirected to the reveal page and voila. The site successfully guessed your location. Now, just to show you that I haven't hard-coded this answer into the site, I am turning on my VPN and connecting to Romania. I am going to do exactly the same thing again and you can also try this by going to my GitHub. The entirety of this project is in the link in my description so you can try this for yourself. It gives the location Romania. And when I turn off the VPN and reload, it goes back to India. So, if you haven't already guessed it, this is how I did it. Because this page is completely independent, we can directly see all the requests this page makes. In the network tab, there is a JSON request made. You can see that it contains info like the latitude, longitude, time zone, internet service provider, zip code etc. Now let's take a look at the code for this website. All the good stuff is in the main.js file. First, I fetched this URL. Let's see what it is in the browser. When this site is opened, it gives location, ISP and other info based on the user's IP address. I then passed this info and passed it into the reveal HTML page and displayed it in a readable format. Websites could theoretically then send this data over to them, without the users ever knowing or suspecting a thing. This is why we must always use a VPN when surfing the web. And no this video is not sponsored by a VPN, if you couldn't already tell by the size of my channel. Thanks for watching and be careful out there.